Prisons are often perceived as the most dangerous and unforgiving places, where violence and despair dominate. Yet, there are remarkable stories that challenge these dark assumptions and reveal the potential for humanity. In an environment where hope often seems scarce, inmates also demonstrate extraordinary behaviors. From prison cameras capturing moments where prisoners saved a corrections officer during a medical emergency to saving the lives of their fellow inmates, these acts of bravery and compassion show a different side of incarceration. Today, we'll explore 20 incredible incidents caught on camera that no human is supposed to see. 20. Saving a life. In a remarkable moment caught on prison cameras, a group of inmates in Georgia jumped into action to save the life of Deputy Patrick Edmund. During a routine cell check, Edmund began to stagger and drop items, clearly in distress. Sensing something was wrong, the prisoners responded quickly. One grabbed a chair to help Edmund sit, while others used the guard's radio to call for help and banged on the walls to alert nearby officers. The prison camera captured their quick coordination, likely saving Edmund from a life-threatening stroke. After undergoing surgery to remove a blood clot, the deputy is now recovering. This unexpected act of kindness challenged the common assumptions about prisoners. Far from being the villains they're often portrayed as, these inmates prove that human compassion thrives, even behind bars. This heartwarming incident serves as a reminder that you should treat people the way you want to be treated. These men stepped up to help, showing that even in the toughest of circumstances, kindness and humanity can shine. 19. Six inmates save officer's life. In a remarkable act of humanity, six prisoners in Polk County, Georgia, helped save the life of a prison guard after he fainted while supervising them in a cemetery. The prisoners were tasked with mowing the lawn in preparation for Father's Day when the guard suddenly collapsed under the hot sun. Instead of fleeing through the open cemetery gate, the inmates immediately sprang into action. They flipped the guard onto his back, checked his pulse and breathing, and unfastened his pistol and vest to perform CPR. One inmate, trained in first aid, administered CPR while another used the guard's phone to call 911. Thanks to their fast response, the prison guard resumed breathing within a minute. The six prisoners stayed by his side, praying and offering comfort until the ambulance arrived. Doctors later confirmed that their quick thinking saved the guard's life. This touching event that no human was supposed to see shows that despite their circumstances, prisoners can demonstrate immense kindness and compassion. 18. Three inmates saved deputy. In July 2020, Gwinnett County Jail in Georgia witnessed a remarkable act of heroism when Deputy Warren Hobbs, 46, suffered a cardiac emergency while on duty. As Hobbs collapsed at his desk, inmates Terry Loveless, Walter Whitehead, and Mitchell Smalls, though locked in their cells, quickly noticed his pain. They began furiously banging on their cell doors and shouting, managing to rouse the semi-conscious deputy just enough for him to unlock the cell doors. The trio then used Hobbs' phone and radio to call 911, ensuring immediate assistance. Prison cameras captured the dramatic moments of their response, showcasing their quick thinking and bravery. Reactions to the incident were overwhelmingly positive, with the Gwinnett County Sheriff's Office praising the inmates' selfless actions. The footage and subsequent interviews gave a powerful message. Heroism and compassion can transcend traditional boundaries of uniform and circumstance. 17. Texas Jail Guard saved by inmates. A shocking incident unfolded at the Texas Parker County Jail in 2016 when Gary Grimm, a seasoned guard with over 20 years of experience, suffered a severe heart attack while on duty. As Grimm fell unconscious in a holding cell basement, surveillance footage captured the remarkable response of the inmates in his care. Initially mistaking his collapse for a prank, the inmates quickly realized the severity of the situation. They began shouting and banging on their cell doors drawing attention to Grimm's plight. Their urgent actions led to their release and the intervention of other staff members who provided critical assistance. Despite the gravity of his condition, Grimm, now retired, remains deeply moved by the prisoner's selfless response. The surveillance video and subsequent reports reveal not only the dramatic rescue, but also Grimm's enduring gratitude and ongoing health struggles. The community's strong support for Grimm shows the impact of his dedicated service and personal kindness reflecting how he has touched countless lives through his work and generosity. 16. Florida Inmate Saved Deputy from Attack In a dramatic turn of events at Hillsborough County Jail, inmate Mary Jean emerged as an unexpected hero on June 7, 2023. Surveillance video captured the harrowing moment when Bridget Harvey, armed with a pillowcase and a sharpened comb, 
attempted to choke Deputy Lillian Jimenez in a planned attack. Harvey had cunningly lured the deputy by pretending another inmate, April Colvin, needed help. As Harvey wrapped the pillowcase around the deputy's neck, which no human was supposed to see, she didn't expect Jean, another inmate, to spring into action. Seeing the deputy in distress with her feet in the air, Jean rushed over, intervening to free the deputy and stop the attack. Her fast response and bravery played a key role in preventing a potentially fatal situation. Jean's heroic act, despite her own legal troubles, was applauded by both the sheriff's office and legal representatives. Surprisingly, this wasn't even the first time Jean had come to the rescue of a detention deputy. Just five months earlier, she had intervened when another deputy was being attacked. The inmate in that case, Stephanie Camera, has been charged with battery of a law enforcement officer and resisting with violence. Jean's consistent bravery under such circumstances highlights her unexpected role as a protector within the jail's environment. 15. Arrested Teen Saves Life In a heartwarming turn of events, 17-year-old Jamal Rutledge transformed from a detainee into an unexpected hero in January 2015. While being booked into the Fort Lauderdale Police Department, Rutledge witnessed Officer Franklin Folks, who was handling his paperwork, suddenly collapse from a suspected heart attack. Surveillance footage captures Rutledge, though handcuffed, urgently kicking a security fence and shouting for help as Folks fell to the floor. His desperate cries for help prompted nearby officers to rush to the scene. They quickly administered CPR and used an automated external defibrillator, actions that proved critical in saving Officer Folks' life. Medical staff at Broward Health Medical Center credited Rutledge's quick thinking with significantly contributing to the officer's survival. Despite his own legal troubles, Rutledge's selfless actions have not gone unnoticed. Fort Lauderdale city officials are set to honor him for his bravery, highlighting a powerful moment of compassion and humanity. This is a powerful reminder that even when things seem tough, people have the capacity to step up and make a real difference. How do you think you'd react in a similar situation? 14. Inmates Save the Life of a Prisoner Sheriff Bob Fletcher hailed three inmates as heroes after they prevented a tragic fall at the Ramsey County Jail in St. Paul in June 2021. That evening, a distressed inmate was threatening to jump from a second-floor balcony. The situation appeared dire as he stood at the edge, but the quick thinking of Deontay Blackwell, Rodolfo Delangel, and Austin Dirks changed the outcome dramatically. Seeing the man in desperation, the trio acted fast. They maneuvered a laundry cart, packed with fresh towels, to position it directly below the balcony. Despite the chaos, their coordination was flawless. As the inmate jumped, the cart successfully cushioned his fall, saving him from serious injury. The man suffered only a twisted ankle, a far cry from the potentially fatal outcome. Sheriff Fletcher praised the inmates for their extraordinary bravery and compassion. Their actions not only saved a life, but also prompted a significant safety upgrade. The Ramsey County Board is set to approve $800,000 for barriers on the second floor, with a total project cost of about $2 million. All three inmates were released a few months later, where their heroism will be remembered as an example of humanity. 13. Inmates help officers rescue a baby. In Newport Ritchie, Florida, a heartwarming rescue unfolded as a group of inmates unexpectedly came to the aid of a one-year-old locked inside an SUV. On a sweltering day, the child's mother, Shadow Lantry, recorded the dramatic moment when the inmates, working nearby, used a wire coat hanger to unlock the vehicle. The toddler had been accidentally locked in the car by her father, who tossed the keys on the front seat and closed the doors. Realizing the severity of the situation that cars can reach deadly temperatures quickly, the inmates sprang into action. Sheriff Chris Nako praised their unique contribution, emphasizing that many individuals who make mistakes still strive to do good. Inmates David Frein and others, under the supervision of Deputy Richard Stanger, successfully opened the door within minutes, avoiding potential harm to the child and also saving the family from the cost of a locksmith. The incident showed the positive impact that second chances can bring, showcasing the prisoner's desire to make amends and help others in need. 12. Officer and Inmates Save Overdose Victim In a powerful display of humanity, inmates from the Essex County Sheriff's Department led by Dennis Decato, saved a man's life on the highway in Lawrence, Massachusetts. The dramatic rescue unfolded as Sergeant Dennis Lobner and his inmate work crew were wrapping up their shift. A frantic woman pulled over, screaming that her boyfriend had overdosed and was unconscious in the passenger seat. 
Sergeant Lobner quickly took control, guiding the 911 call and assessing the situation. Meanwhile, Dicado and his fellow inmates acted swiftly. With Dicado's experience as a former user, he administered crucial CPR and rescue breathing, while others provided vital support. Their fast actions revived the victim before paramedics arrived, who then administered Narcan to stabilize him. This heroic effort was deeply personal for Sergeant Lobner, who lost his son to a heroin overdose 10 months prior. His gratitude was immense as he commended the prisoner's bravery for saving a life. 11. Inmate. Honored for saving deputy. Curtis Harrell, an inmate at the Chesapeake Correctional Center, was recently honored with a Citizen Service Award for a dramatic act of heroism while behind bars. During a workforce program over the summer, Harrell found himself in an unexpected life-or-death situation. Deputy Robert Wrench, who was instructing inmates on job skills, suddenly began choking on his food. Harrell, who had just learned the Heimlich maneuver from Wrench himself, jumped into action. The tension was palpable as Harrell performed the Heimlich maneuver for the first time. He felt the gravity of the moment deeply, knowing that his actions could mean the difference between life and death. With intense focus and a racing heartbeat, he managed to dislodge the food, saving Wrench's life. Wrench, deeply moved by Harold's quick response, acknowledged that the outcome could have been very different without his intervention. Harold, now recognized for his bravery, expressed that he would always be ready to help someone in need, underscoring the powerful connection between mentor and student in a moment of crisis. 10. Inmate helped save guard. Antonio Dwayne Brown, initially sentenced to one and a half to five years in prison, has had his sentence reduced and will be released early following his brave actions in the Kent County Jail. Brown, who had been convicted of fleeing from police, made headlines not just for his past, but for a heroic act that occurred shortly after his sentencing. On September 14th, while still in custody, Brown intervened during a critical incident where a female corrections officer was being attacked by an inmate, Willie Williams. The officer had unknowingly allowed Williams to hide behind a pillar after a routine cell check. Williams later ambushed her, causing chaos by releasing other inmates. As the situation escalated, Brown was among the first to respond, physically separating Williams from the officer and helping to stabilize the situation. His quick thinking likely saved the officer's life and prevented further harm. Kent County Sheriff Larry Stelma, recognizing Brown's heroism, recommended to Judge Mark Trusock that Brown's sentence be reconsidered. The judge, moved by the account of Brown's actions and with input from the prosecutor, decided to reduce Brown's sentence and grant him credit for time served. While he waits to resolve a probation violation from Indiana, his commendable actions have earned him a second chance and a renewed sense of purpose. 9. Incarcerated men and officer, honored for heroic rescue. In a remarkable turn of events, three incarcerated men and a correctional officer have been recognized as heroes after their courageous actions saved the life of a woman attacked in Vacaville. While working on a crew to clean a creek, Darnell Armstrong, William Goins, and Davian Howard heard desperate screams and rushed to the scene. What they found was a chaotic and violent situation. A woman was being viciously attacked on a nearby bike trail. Without hesitation, the men intervened, subduing the assailant and providing immediate help to the injured woman. Their bravery didn't stop there as they also assisted in stabilizing the woman until medical help arrived. Their selfless actions not only demonstrated their commitment to doing good, but also highlighted their personal growth and transformation. At a ceremony held by the Vacaville Police Department, and California Medical Facility. They were honored for their heroism that no human was supposed to see. 8. Inmates Help Woman Alert Police In a dramatic turn of events at a Florida prison, a dangerous situation unfolded when an inmate seized control, leading to an escape and kidnapping. During a chaotic lunch break, David Ross, armed with a knife, took a corrections officer hostage and locked other inmates in a bathroom. Amid the turmoil, four prisoners and a woman in a nearby park played pivotal roles. The woman, witnessing the unfolding crisis, dialed 911 and provided crucial details to dispatchers. Her timely call was instrumental in alerting authorities, despite the escapee being on the run by the time the police arrived. Remarkably, the cooperation of the prisoners did not go unnoticed. Their swift actions, including helping the woman reach out for help, played a key role in resolving the situation. David Ross was eventually captured in St. Petersburg with the assistance of cell phone tracking by the corrections officer. 7. Prisoners Save Fellow Inmates 
Another dramatic scene, captured by prison cameras in California, shows inmates stepping up in a crisis. When two fellow prisoners suffered apparent drug overdoses and collapsed, their fellow inmates acted quickly, administering Narcan, an overdose-reversing medication. Their quick intervention played a very important part in averting a potential tragedy. According to the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department, the affected inmates received immediate medical care and were soon stable enough to return to their housing units. In response, the prison has intensified its efforts on overdose prevention, ensuring that inmates are well equipped with both the knowledge and tools to manage such emergencies effectively. 6. Inmates Save Deputies' Life In Tampa, Florida, a detention deputy's life was saved by the quick actions of four inmates who stepped in during a sudden ambush. The incident took place at the Hillsborough County Jail when prison cameras show how an inmate charged Deputy Ken Moon, putting him in a chokehold and nearly strangling him. Moon's life was hanging by a thread when the inmates risked their own safety to intervene. Jerry Dieguez Jr., one of the rescuers, used his Marine Corps training to subdue the attacker. Alongside Terrell Carswell and others, they managed to pry the assailant off Moon just in time. The inmates knew they were saving not only an officer's life, but someone who had treated them with dignity and compassion. Their bravery that night showed that even in the toughest of circumstances, people can come together to protect life. Thanks to their intervention, Deputy Moon survived with only minor injuries, and the attacker is now facing additional charges. 5. Inmates Saving Lives Through Canine Cellmates In the Fulton County Jail, prisoners are not only finding redemption, but also saving lives through an innovative program called Canine Cellmates. Founded by Susan Jacobs Meadows, the program pairs nonviolent inmates with shelter dogs that are on the verge of being euthanized. Over the course of 10 weeks, these inmates train and bond with their assigned dogs, providing them with the skills and behavior needed for adoption. Prison cameras show how inmates and dogs bond. For the prisoners, this experience is transformative. Many have lost trust in society and themselves, feeling forgotten or judged. But as they work with their canine companions, they experience a renewed sense of purpose. The bond they build with the dogs is a testament to their ability to care, teach, and nurture, restoring their own confidence and humanity. The program gives both inmates and dogs a second chance, offering the prisoners a path toward rehabilitation and the dogs a shot at a loving home. In the span of two years, 50 dogs were saved with the participation of 80 inmates. 4. Inmate Helps – Jailer During Attack A detention officer at the Payne County Jail in Oklahoma was ambushed by an inmate leaving him vulnerable and in danger. In a surprising twist, another inmate intervened to rescue the officer, stepping up when backup failed to arrive. The attacker, identified as Tashka Marit, had asked to use the restroom and then launched a violent assault on Officer Matthew Hudson when his cell was opened. With no immediate help available due to budget cuts, Hudson found himself pinned and slammed to the ground. However, Robert Hammock, another inmate who was awaiting release, sprang into action he tackled the attacker, pulling him off the officer and preventing the situation from escalating further. The incident shows the humanity that can exist behind bars, as Hammock's quick thinking and bravery likely prevented a more serious outcome. 3. Inmates Help Officers In a tense moment at the Mahoning County Jail in Ohio, Deputy Anthony Lucas found himself in a life-threatening situation. Inmate Lucky Mitchell launched a surprise attack, attempting to strangle the officer with a homemade noose made from a t-shirt. What could have ended in tragedy took a surprising turn when two other inmates stepped in to save Lucas as footage from prison cameras shows. As Mitchell tightened his grip, the inmates quickly intervened, holding the attacker back long enough for help to arrive. Their quick actions likely saved Lucas's life as he struggled to reach his radio and call for backup during the altercation. Their decision to protect the officer, in a situation that could have easily escalated, shows the potential for human decency to shine through, even in the most confined and challenging environments. 2. Inmates Save Choking Officer At the Davidson County Downtown Detention Center in Nashville, an extraordinary act of heroism unfolded when a group of inmates rushed to the aid of a choking corrections officer. The dramatic rescue, captured in real time by prison surveillance cameras, highlighted their remarkable response under pressure. On August 5th, a female corrections officer began choking on an obstruction, causing immediate alarm among the inmates. Without hesitation, one inmate sprang into action, performing the Heimlich maneuver with precision, successfully dislodging the blockage and restoring her ability to breathe. 
As the officer lost consciousness, another inmate swiftly grabbed her radio, calling for backup and ensuring that help was on the way. The quick and compassionate actions of these inmates were instrumental in preventing a potential tragedy. Their kindness and responsibility within the confines of the prison system saved a life. 1. Inmates help others on the cell block. At SCI Waymart in Wayne County, Pennsylvania, a groundbreaking initiative is changing lives behind bars. Inmates with mental illnesses are receiving crucial support from their peers through a dedicated program that trains fellow prisoners to offer emotional and practical assistance. In this unique program, 11 inmates are trained as certified peer support specialists, using their personal experiences with mental health issues to guide and support their peers. These specialists undergo 75 hours of training and continuous education, learning how to provide crucial support and recognize signs of distress among their fellow inmates. In the facility's classroom, inmates practice exercises designed to build empathy and understanding. Brandon, a peer support specialist, shares his own experiences with hearing voices to help others cope with similar struggles. This peer support model not only empowers the inmates who are receiving help, but also boosts the self-esteem and sense of purpose for those offering support. By fostering strong connections and shared experiences, the program creates a supportive network that enhances mental health care within the prison system. This innovative approach demonstrates how prisoners can effectively help each other, offering hope and resilience in an otherwise challenging environment. These incidents reshape our perspective on the prison system, showing that heroism and humanity can emerge from the most unexpected places. It challenges us to rethink our assumptions about redemption and compassion. How do these acts of bravery shift your view on second chances and the potential for change? Share your thoughts below.